Welcome to How Do I Become a Citizen of Dominica for $50,000. Well in this video we will cover two ways on how you can become a citizen of the Commonwealth of Dominica. And, neither of them cost 50,000 American dollars. Continue watching this video to learn about these ways of becoming a citizen of the Commonwealth of Dominica and then, you can decide which way is more appropriate for you. If haven't subscribed and find value here, please like and subscribe to at Wadenwavengel. Those who have already subscribed thank you. So let's begin. To answer the question of how do I become a citizen of Dominica, Dominica, let's look at the first of two ways covered in this video. Becoming a citizen of Dominica involves involves an application process which typically includes providing evidence of one's financial stability, identity documents, medical records and police clearance certificates. The exact requirements may differ depending on the type of citizenship you are applying for. Generally speaking, applicants must pay a fee to obtain their certificate and meet any other conditions that are specified in the application form. Once you have submitted all of the required documents and paid the fees, your citizenship application will be reviewed and determined by an immigration officer. If approved, you will receive a passport that confirms your citizenship status. In addition to meeting the requirements outlined in the application process, applicants must also demonstrate a commitment to Dominica's culture and values. This includes a good understanding of Dominica's history, laws, customs, and traditions. Additionally, applicants must demonstrate knowledge about the country's economy, politics, language and society. Does Dominica allow dual citizenship? Yes, Dominica allows citizens to have dual citizenship. This is a great advantage for applicants as it allows them to maintain their current citizenship while also being able to take advantage of the numerous benefits that come with becoming a citizen of Dominica. Dual citizenship holders in Dominica are eligible for full protection under the laws and regulations of both countries. However, please note that some countries may not recognize dual citizenship, so it is important to check with the relevant authorities in your country. It should also be noted that certain countries may require applicants to renounce their current citizenship upon accepting Dominion citizenship. So it's important to research this in advance and talk to an immigration advisor if needed. How do I become a tax resident in Dominica? Dominica offers a number of incentives for becoming a tax resident, including no capital gains taxes, zero or low income taxes, and corporate income taxes as low as 2.5%. To qualify for residency in Dominica, you must have a valid Dominica passport, or one from another country that is accepted, live in Dominica for at least 183 days per year, have a residence in Dominica, and demonstrate that you have sufficient funds to support yourself, or your family. Once you've met all of these requirements, you can apply for a certificate of tax residency. This will confirm to the authorities that you are a legitimate tax resident and allow you to take advantage of the incentives that Dominica offers. Can an American get Dominica, Dominica citizenship? Yes, it is possible for an American citizen to obtain citizenship from the Commonwealth of Dominica. However, there are some criteria that must be met in order for the application to be successful. Applicants will need to meet specific financial and residency requirements to qualify for citizenship. Additionally, applicants may need to pass a background check and provide proof of a clean criminal record. As stated before, this video would cover two ways of becoming a citizen of Dominica, Dominica and here's the second way which is citizenship by investment. This is an attractive option for many people who want to gain access to any country's benefits and opportunities. Through its citizenship by investment program, Dominica offers an economic route to gaining citizenship with a non-refundable financial contribution towards a government fund or an approved real estate business. 
This program requires a minimum investment of at least US$100,000 which must be paid through a verified banking institution. The investment must be kept for a minimum of five years. After this time, applicants can apply for Dominican citizenship provided they meet all other requirements set out by the government. Applicants who are considering this option should ensure that they understand the process and criteria for obtaining citizenship. They will need to make sure that their application meets all of the requirements in order to be successful. Applicants may also be asked to provide additional documents such as proof of employment or education in order to support their application for citizen. By investment, ultimately, it is up to the discretion of the immigration officer to determine if an applicant meets all requirements for citizenship. By investment, if you have any questions about the application process or requirements, please contact a qualified immigration advisor. Additionally, it may be beneficial to consult with a professional who can help guide you through the process of obtaining citizenship in Dominica. With their expertise and knowledge, they can ensure that your application meets all of the criteria and that you are able to gain citizenship in the quickest possible time. They can also provide further advice and tips on how best to maintain your investment over the required five years. I hope this information is helpful in giving you an overview of the Citizenship by Investment program in Dominica, on how best to maintain your investment over the required five years. I hope this information is helpful in giving you an overview of the Citizenship by Investment program in Dominica. Overall, investing in Dominica citizenship can provide many advantages including visa-free travel to a range of countries. However, it is essential to understand the financial commitments involved and to weigh the pros and cons before making a final decision. It is best to consult with a professional who can help guide you through the process of obtaining citizenship in Dominica. With their expertise and knowledge, they can ensure that your application meets all of the criteria and that you are able to gain citizenship in the quickest possible time. They can also provide further advice and tips on how best to maintain your investment over the required five years. I hope this information is helpful in giving you an overview of the Citizenship by Investment program in Dominica. If you are still wondering, how do I become a citizen of Dominica for $50,000? Remember Dominica does not sell citizenship, but you can accomplish this by participating in their citizenship by investment program also remember that investment monies are non-refundable and it is important to consider costs associated with maintaining the investment over time these include ongoing payments such as annual fees and taxes that may be imposed by the government if you find value here please like and subscribe for more information on dominica citizenship for fifty thousand us dollars Visit the website of the Government of Dominica or contact a local lawyer for advice. Thanks for watching and subscribing.